Hello, and welcome to another edition of Beaver Finance. I'm your host, Robert T. Anderson. In today's series, I'm here to talk to you about RESPs. An RESP stands for Registered Education Savings Plans. This is another type of registered savings account in Canada. These plans allow you to save for your child's education. Now, if you have more than one child, you you have the option of either setting up an individual RESP or you could choose to set up a family RESP so you can pool all your resources together. Um, This is sometimes a great option um, in case one child doesn't go to school, uh, the other children are able to uh, use that, that money as well. So that's great. Um, and by contributing to this RESP, your contributions can earn grants, uh, and depending on your income, it could earn an additional bond, um, which is income tested. Now contributions, um, available, um, up to a limit in RESPs, uh, that limit is 50,000 that you're allowed to contribute. Uh, the government will c- contribute uh, 20% uh, up to a maximum of $7,200 per child. Uh, so in order to max out your RESP, uh, an annual contribution of $2,500 uh, will generate the full $500. N- now, you may be wondering, uh, what about the growth in a tax f- or in an RESP? Uh, The money that grows in an RESP, uh, whether that's interest, uh, dividends, or capital gains, uh, can grow tax-free. And it's not until the child actually goes to school upon withdrawal of the funds uh, that it's taxed in the child's hands at that later date. Um, So that's handy in the sense that it won't affect your income uh, as the parent, as by the time your child goes to post-secondary education, you'll probably be in a much higher income tax bracket than you are today. As far as options for investments, you, you have a complete wide range, everything from stocks, uh, bonds, uh, ETFs, and mutual funds. Thank you for listening to another edition of Beaver Finance. We hope you learned a lot about RESPs. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow, and and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. Bye.